Hey guys, it's Ricky Gibbs here, and I'm back with another episode of Assassin's Creed 1. When we left off, this is where we left off, obviously, so let's go. Hello, ye again. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is yeah, to wield yeah, the blade. You said this about Perhaps three times you could already. show them what you know. Okay. If you're getting me to. I won't mind a fight. Oh, that's a new skill Altair's learnt. The work of a master. That, awesome. my students, is how we all should fight. Thank you. You must be busy. I understand. Now let's head on. We got three locations we can go to. So let's go to one of them. Show our target doom. It's a go. Now we gotta get down, get our horse, and travel on. What did I do there? I feel like we've traveled on this road so many times, but it's fun, so I don't mind. Take this jump! Hoya! Beastly horse. Let's go to Kingdom. Ah! So I can uh, actually fast travel to them now. It's cool. Which one do I want to go to first? Let's try Damascus. Now, we're fast traveling Use down to Damascus. To gather information about your surroundings. Yes, thank you. And we're already in Damascus. Let's get back to this bureau. It's because I've discovered all three and went to all three, it's gonna let me do this now. Oh crap. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, back here. Beautiful. These guys are already here, so let's join them. They can get me through the guards again. There'll be another district of the city that we can look through for this new target that we're going for. That music there sounds very Egyptian. Speaking of Egyptian, the next game coming out, Assassin's Creed Origins, is gonna be set in Egypt, so I'm looking forward to it. I'm so excited. Can't wait. Now we're revisiting the very first game that started the series. Now, to make my way to the Assassin Bureau. Let's are free and clear the guards. Now, I'll be okay. Because I'm in the city. I can travel over then. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry about that as well. Let me go. Uh. 
for your sin. Sorry about that guard, don't kill me. They actually are. Frig off. <laughs> No, I'm getting away. Like this. Boom. A crusade for you are wise, ignorant, which is why you are unto me. Madness. You do well, you are. Resist. We must fight them in any way we can. And boom, I escaped. Just by bumping into a guard, he tried. He chased me and tried to kill me. Anyone help me? And I'm back to the bureau. Ah, no, no, get in. Hello. This guy's nicer. Altair, my friend. Welcome, welcome. Whose life do you come to collect today? His name is Abu Nakud. Uh -huh. What can you tell me about him? Oh, the merchant king of Damas, richest man in the city. Quite exciting, quite dangerous. I envy you, Altair. Well, not the bit where you were beaten and stripped of your rank, <laughs> but I envy everything else. Oh, except for the terrible things the other assassins say about you. But yes, aside from the failure and the <laughs> hatred, yes, aside from those things, I envy you very much. I do not care what the others think or say. I'm here to do a job. So I ask again. What can you tell me about the Merchant King? Only that he must be a very bad man if Al Mualim has sent you to see him. He keeps to his own kind, wrapped in the finery of this city's noble district. A busy uh -huh. man, always up to something. I'm sure if you spend some time amongst his type, you'll learn all you need to know about him. And where would you have me begin my search? If I were you, I'd start with the Omayyad Mosque and Souk Saruja, both of which are west of here. Further to the northwest is Salahadin Citadel. It's a popular meeting spot and has proved a reliable uh -huh. source of loose tongues in the past. Yes, these three places should serve your needs. Thank My thanks you. for your guidance, Rafiq. I'll return when I've gathered the necessary information. Now, let's go get it. This time, because I didn't need a viewpoint, I didn't get an investigation first, so it's two to look for this time. No. Most likely the red we're going. He said he's the richest man in all of Damascus. So we will go here. And we'll start looking for a viewpoint. Oh no, I fell. Let's go. I'm already in now. There's a few points here, I'm pretty sure. Why would he do that? Won't be easy to get up onto. But I could get up. Oh. Not like that. Not like that. Come on, like this. Come on. Up. Whoa. Who just threw that at me? Is that that woman coming to ask if I had any money? There's a few point it looks like. It's not marked on the map. Nothing is marked at the moment. Let's go. Oh, don't fall, I'll tell you. Let's look. In this viewpoint, see if we can find anything. Very high down. Such a beautiful city. Nothing. Well, now I've unlocked more viewpoints. Most likely, they give us something. Sorry, woman. Out of my way. Hello, man. I will pickpocket you. Thank you. What's he running from? I'm running from your ma. Oh, <laughs> that's an overused joke. Oh. 
Let's climb this. Ah, oh, no! And he fell. Ah, around here. Something to climb up. Up. You'd be afraid of falling. Oh, lovely view. Let's see what you see out there. Nothing. Uh, the time being, I can unlock everything in this part. If I get all the viewpoints anyway, so... Spend time getting those. It could be a longer episode, but... Who cares, you enjoy it, right? Right? <laughs> See, I listened where he said to go, but it's hard to find it! Altair, why did you do that? Good. I claim. Ooh. Very high up. Oh, guard. And I will silence him then. Perfect way to silence a guard. attention to what's going on behind you. Oh. Find where this pickpocket is going on. Or where I have to pickpocket someone. There we go. What is that fool doing? Come! You won't be and I mean, huh. she just say call the cops? This is in historical times. Aha. It was good there. of you to come. It is an honor to serve. What do you require? The letter I've given you must be brought it. to Salahaddin's camp. Seek out the one they call Hisham. He will be able to help. But tell no one else of this. None will know my mission. Then our business is concluded. Sounds like Malik. Probably the same voice actor. holding a festival within his palace. It's perfect information to know. Oh. Go to another viewpoint. I need to find some more information. About the Merchant King. Sorry, well, I don't have any coins, woman. Oh, 
Don't sorry, do sorry. Don't kill me. Idiots. Oh, there's water. <gasps> no! And I'll tell you about your arm. <laughs> because you can't swim when in this you're out of knives, refill your stock by returning. But I don't think it was a uh, like production hold up. I think it was because oh, I'm back here anyway. It was because in the story the Anubis at this point didn't allow like swimming, so yeah. Now let's go. Hey. Hold on. Here's some red and blue. Yes, I knew it. This is a mission. Praise Just found it myself. Who saved our city from certain destruction? He spent his own coin huh. to see us fed and clothed. His men. Tend to the fires that we might be warm. His kindness knows no bounds. Everything really. we now have, we have because of him. Really? The merchant king provides for one and all. He asks for nothing in return. Let his generosity serve as an example to us all. Everyone should. Oh, I'm in. They didn't realize a thing. I just climbed over. Can't do that every time, but I could do it that time because I found an opening. Now, to where are you going? This looks secluded enough. You're not gonna beat me. Got you. I'll talk, I'll talk. I have no interest in dying for him. His coin's not worth my life. A wise decision. What is it you want? I have business with the Merchant King. Ha! Huh? Good luck with that. He rarely leaves his chambers. Why? Is he afraid? Not uh -huh. fear. Hate. He hates himself as much as he hates the people he pretends to serve. Locks himself away in his personal quarters out of shame. He can't stay hidden forever. No. Those celebrations of his. He comes out to speak. To look down upon the people. A sense of belonging, I suppose. However brief. What's wrong with him that he would hide like this? You'll see. Now let me go. Let you go? So you can tell him of my plan? I won't say a thing. <laughs> no, you won't. Oh. Hmm. Come out to speak to these people during his feast. Ah, I haven't got enough information. Need one more this time. I won't stay to the roofs this time in case I happen to come across some things without. Oh no, yeah, I have to get through the suit again. Second day. Let's get around and over like this. <laughs> All right, just literally nothing to climb here. Okay then. <laughs> I had a good plan, but my climbing plan something that you can do in the next game and not this one. Assassin's Creed 2 
You can do the certain type of climbing I was doing there. Oh no. Altair climbed the ladder. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't work. I knew it. Ooh, that would hurt. Gotta go, gotta go. You're on my tail. No, 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 no. <sighs> Got it. Can't assassinate them for me. Now let's climb this few points, see what I can't find. Aha! Pay for your sins! No. Oh! Okay then. I'll fight with my hidden blade this time. Oh! That was epic. Investigation. Well, then I can go back. Then I can go back to the bureau and actually assassinate the guy. See, so is there anything I can investigate into around here? There is. Foolish old man. Okay then. Is there a bench anywhere? <laughs> Boy, stop hitting me. Sitting on a nearby bench. Aha! There, I can listen in from here. There's a problem. I need your advice. What is it? This morning, I went to hang the lanterns for the party. And this troubles you why? I... I forgot to remove the scaffold. Forgot it where? Just outside the Merchant King's quarters, above the balcony. Huh. Well, what if it falls? It could be hurt. Too late to do anything about it now. Just hope it isn't noticed. <laughs> you can deal with it tomorrow. Right, so I found out there's a passage leading up to Merchant King's quarters. Now, I'm ready to return to the Bureau. Let's go. My family is sick and dying. Could you spare a few things? Don't have any someone. money? My family is sick and dying. You, sir, you look like you need something. You'll find it here. I'm sure it's very important. He's going to run into someone. Here we are. He went quiet for a bit there. Nice. <laughs> And we're back. Now let's start this mission. Peace be upon you, Altair. How may I serve you? I've done as asked and learned all I need to know about my prey. 
Then you must share your knowledge uh, with pray. me. Pray. Abu Naqud is corrupt to the core and despised by his own citizens as a result. It appears he's been stealing money meant for the people of Damas and spending it on himself. Even as we speak, he flaunts his greed, preparing for a lavish party. His guards and servants should have their hands full dealing with the guests. They won't even know I'm there. Most impressive, my friend. The others said you'd make a mess of things, but <laughs> not I. No, I was sure you'd come through, and come through you have. Yep. The bureau is yours to do with as you please until you're ready to begin. Thank you. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent no. one. Let's get a Bunakud. Strike the merchant king when he comes out during his feast to speak with the people. You no. dare steal in my presence? That will cost you your life. I'm coming, merchant king. This is it. Fish! You are fit! Sons were half as brave as you. <laughs> I'll see to it that they no hear problem. this tale and know what it is to be a true hero. Ah. Thank you. You guys can help me, right? They say it is a crusade. A crusade for one. Uh, take me. We lose guards, guys. A Bunakud will have it. Let's go. Being secretive, blending in to this crowd of scholars. This'll work. We're in. I tricked the guards. Where are they heading to? I think this'll be okay. Thank you for your help. This is where I need to be. My targets up there. Here he is. A Bunakud. Welcome, welcome. Thank you all for joining me this evening. Please eat, drink, enjoy all the pleasures I have to offer. Take your time, I will wait. I trust everything is to your satisfaction. Good. 
Good, good. It pleases me to see you all so happy. For uh -huh. these are dark days, my friends, and we must enjoy this bounty while we still can. War threatens to consume us all. Salah Hadin bravely fights for what he believes in, Does and you are know? always there to support him without question. It is your generosity that allows his campaign to continue. So, I propose a toast then, to you, my dear friends, who have brought us to where we are today. May you be given everything you deserve for it. Aha! Everything they Such deserve. kindness! I didn't think it in you! You, who have been so quick to judge me, and so cruel. Oh, do not feign ignorance. Do you take me for a fool? That I have not heard the words you whispered behind my back. Well, I have, and I feel I can never forget you. But this is not why I called you here tonight, no. I wish to speak more of this war and your part in it. You give up your coin quick as can be, knowing all too well it buys the deaths of thousands. You don't even know why we fight. The sanctity of the Holy Land, you'll say. Or the evil inclination of our enemies. But these are lies you tell yourselves. <laughs> no. All this suffering is born of fear and hate. It bothers you that they are different. Just as it bothers you that I am different. Uh-huh. You're different. In what way? Compassion. Mercy. Tolerance. These words mean nothing to any of you. Mean nothing to those infidel invaders who ravage our land in search of gold and glory. And so I say, enough! I pledge myself to another cause. One that will bring about a new world in which all people might live side by side in hmm. peace. A pity none of you will live to see it. It's poison there. It's poison there. No. Kill anyone who tries to escape. Coming for you. So he just poisoned him. You will die here. No, I won't. But you will. Die. Die. Ugh. You're not killing these people. Oh. Don't be a coward, Abin. Show yourself. Oh wait, you are. And I'm coming for you. Right this is I love this scene. Didn't expect this to be the end, did you? Think again, Abrin. That's what you get. Be at peace now. Their words can no longer do harm. Why have you done this? You stole money from those you claim to lead. Sent it away for some unknown purpose. I want to know where it's gone and why. Look at me. My very nature is an affront to the people I ruled. And these huh. noble robes did little more than to muffle their shouts of hate. Mm -hmm. So this is about vengeance then? No, not vengeance. But my conscience 
How could I finance a war in service to the same god that calls me an abomination? Ooh, if you do not serve Salah Dean's cause, then whose? In time, you'll come to know them. I mm -hmm. think perhaps you already do. Then why oh. hide? And why these dark deeds? Is it so different from your own work? You take the lives of men and women, strong in the conviction that their deaths will improve the lots of those left behind. A minor evil for a greater good? We are the same. No, we are nothing alike. Ah, but I see it in your eyes. You doubt. You cannot stop us. We will have our new world. Ooh, ooh. Goodbye, Abu Nakud. We love the gates. It's a Bakura massacre. We need to get out of here. They're not getting me alive. Perfect. Don't try to kill me. Do you not see what a Punaku just did? No wonder I did what I did there. Gotta get out of here. I can get I can get out, I can escape. Oh he's waiting for me. So many. Oh, No, you're not getting me. You know what? I'm standing my ground. Who's next? Yeah. Get all. I'm gonna win. Whoa. Now. Some hidden blade action. Oh, how do you like that? Get out of here! combat animation. has reached me of your success, Altair. Has it? Abu Nakud's reign of terror is at an end. Yes, I'm it is. I'm glad to hear it. He killed them. The men and women at his party. It was poison. A coward's tool. Blamed them for the war. Said he wished to end it. Uh-huh. Strange. But then again, the Merchant King was known to be a bit... different. Perhaps this uh. was simply a symptom of his madness. Perhaps. You sound unconvinced. Speak with Al-Mualam then. He may offer a better explanation. Yes. Yes. We'll see what he has to say. Thank you. 
Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. No. I think the kid is gone. Use counterattacks when faced with multiple enemies to gain the advantage in combat. Wah, 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 Word has reached me of your success. You have my gratitude and that of the realm. Oh, thank Freeing you. Freeing these cities from their corrupt leaders will no doubt promote the cause of peace. Can you really be so sure? The means by which men rule are reflected in their people. As you cleanse the cities of corruption, you heal the hearts and minds of those who live within. Our enemies would disagree. What do you mean? Each man I've slain has confessed strange words to me. Huh. They are without regret. Even in death they seem confident of their success. Mm -hmm. Though they do not admit it directly, there is a tie that binds them. I'm sure of it. There is a difference, Altair, between what we are told to be true and what we see to be true. Huh. Most men do not bother to make the distinction. It is simpler that way. But as an assassin, it is your nature to notice, to question. Then what is it that connects these men? Ah, but as an assassin, it is also your duty to still these thoughts and trust huh. in your master. For there can be no true peace without order, and uh. order requires authority. You speak in circles, master. You commend me for being aware, then ask me not to be. Which is it? The question will be answered when you no longer need to ask it. I assume you called me here for more than just a lecture. Very well. A rank and weapon are again restored to you. Two more leaders remain. Go and see to it that their rule is ended. Okay, I will, Master. Nice. Ah, now guys, thank you for watching this episode. Ugh. I will do one more today, and then that'll be it. So thank, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one today. Peace. Bam.